Hey YouTube, Untamed here. So I am out at Arisman Chantilly Toyota in Virginia and this is admittedly the lowest markup I've seen on this particular color Forerunner TRD Pro. So this is, as you guys know, the Lunar Rock, or excuse me, the Lime Rush Forerunner TRD Pro uh, for 2022 here. And honestly, the more I see it, it does grow on me. Um, I wish it wasn't as pale of a green. Um, I do wish it was a little bit more like the electric line metallic on the Tacoma. I think that's a little bit more special and it pops more. Whereas this, you know, is, as you guys know, I think the Kia Soul comes in a very similar color <laughs> as this. Uh, same with uh, same with the Prius at one point, the Prius being a little bit lighter. Um, but it is growing on me. And honestly, in, when I see it in different lights and, and shading, it it looks a lot better. Sometimes it glows, which I love. But then in certain lightings, it looks super pale. So good and bad, really. I'd be curious to know what your guys' thoughts are on it. But you know the drill. I'll do a quick walk around of it. This one is not really specced out. Um, no clear bra. Um, got the cheapest option running boards on it. Um, so pretty buttermilk basic, really. And, and honestly, you know, getting one, for me, I always prefer to get them with, with less things on them to bring the MSRP a little bit lower. So the MSRP in this one, I believe, is just over 53000 um, Whereas you can easily get them up to 57000 if you spec them out with the Predator side two steps, you know, the rear emblem covers, if you get tint through through the dealership, of course, the front clear bra, uh, the center gun safe that you get in the center console. There's a number of things that can bring up the price tag pretty quick. But it is growing on me. I remember when I went out to that trip in northern Georgia to test drive a few of the Forerunners and Tacomas up there. I remember I just, I don't know, I did not gravitate to it. But the more I see it, it is growing on me. I'll show you the sticker here. So it should be that much. But it has a 10 grand markup. And I hate saying that that's not that bad, because it, it really isn't, you know? But still, I don't encourage anybody to pursue a markup, because even if you pay five grand over, you're propelling the issue. So about 64,000 is what we're looking at for this one. But according to the sales manager in there, and, and I believe him, he said it's the lowest marked up Forerunner Tierty Pro in Lime Rush in the entire region out here. So I think three state radius is by the way he explained it. So, and I believe him, and it's a shame that that is the case because 10 grand is still disgusting. So I, I prefer it if they don't drill, pre drill these just because obviously, yeah, it cuts into your front balance there. Um, but if you can keep it without, it looks sleeker, of course. But, all right, team. Well, I'm going to show you one more, I think, because every vehicle I've seen out here does have a markup, it looks like. And they all seem to be sporting a 10% markup. So $4,100 markup, bringing this one to just under 50 or over 49 The Tacoma, obviously not a, a TRD off-road, but still. Every single one of them out here has a 10% markup on it, which is absolutely crazy. But anyway, guys, you know the drill. Appreciate you watching, as always. Let me know if what the largest markup you've seen lately is. Appreciate you watching. Until next time.